<laughs> what's up y'all welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is imani danielle i'm a girl boss i'm a girl queen i'm a plus size babe and i would love if you guys would join my family on here <laughs> so make sure that you hit the subscribe button also don't forget to hit the bell notification to be notified anytime that i upload an actual video and if this is just your first time here then what's up what's good what's popping today I'm going to be telling you guys a story. So, I asked you guys on my Instagram if you wanted to hear a story about the time a NFL player slid in my DMs. I'm going to say I have a story. So, um, I do have some receipts to match because I know people probably will be like, girl, she lying. This is a story she made up. But I do have the DM um, to back my story up. I don't remember the exact date, to be honest. And I probably should have looked at that before I start filming this. But this has been months ago. It probably was like... Maybe September, -ish, October, maybe even August, somewhere in there. Um, I got this DM and I get DMs all the time. Like I'm not sitting here trying to tool my horn and suck my own tits, but I do get DMs all the time on Instagram. And I got this DM and when I looked at it, it went to my request box. So I only check my request box every so often on Instagram. So when I got the DM I went to my request box. So I was in my request box looking through them, just scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. And the reason why I caught my eyes because it had the little verified check mark beside it. So I was like, who is this? Who is this is verified messaging me? So when I pulled the account up, um, the guy was just like, hey, or whatever. And um, I went to his page because I was like, who is this? So I went to his page and for an NFL player, he didn't have that many followers. Like, girl. He didn't have that many followers. I think he had like 4,000 followers or so, maybe 5,000 followers. But when I went through his, um, when I looked at his page, he had like all these pictures of him in um, football gear and like working out and him actually been like playing and practicing and stuff like that. So this guy that messaged me, he played for the Rams and I think... I don't know where that's at, y'all, to be honest. But he played for the Rams. Correct me if I'm wrong. Once I find out the official team, I'm going to put it on the screen for y'all. But he did play for the Rams, wherever they're from. I think it's St. Louis something. I don't, I don't know. But he played for the Rams. And um, when he messaged me, I was like, is this a scam? Like, you catfishing somebody? Like, why? If you play for the Rams, why you ain't got that many followers, you know? So, long short, long story short, um, we was messaging or whatever. It was real short talk. He was boring as hell. So, um, I just gave him, like, boring ass conversation because he was boring. Um, but when I found out, like, he was in the NFL, I was like, girl, girl, like, you really that pop, you, you really popping like that for somebody like that to message you. But, y'all, he was boring. He wasn't, like, <laughs> he wasn't interesting. He wasn't, like, trying to get to know nobody or nothing like that. Plus, um, I just wasn't, like, I could feel off front where his vibe was at. He was just trying to, but, um, yeah, he wasn't, he wasn't interested. He wasn't interesting at all. He was very boring. Um, and he wasn't, I mean, he, he was on the team, but he was, like, I don't really know exactly how the NFL works because I don't watch football, but he wasn't, like, officially... A player on the team if that makes sense he was like a, um i guess like redshirted or something i don't know how it is like pretty much he t what he told me and it's in the dms but pretty much what it's like is like he was on their practice team or something and when he was on their practice team you get the chance to like kind of kind of like audition to be on our team i guess you can say and he didn't make the cut so they cut him so he was with them for like a whole year on their practice team. And after a year, they cut him. He didn't make it. I don't know why. I guess he was, he was sorry. I don't know. But he didn't make it. So, yeah, that's pretty much my story. Um, like I said, he was hella boring. And like even when I went um, back to his page like later on, there was like hella girls that he followed that I followed too. So I was like, this nigga either trying to get some clout off of one of us or he just... I don't know, but you can tell right off the bat, like, he wasn't interested in, like, what I was interested in. He was interested in, and that's about it. So, yeah, that's a struggle story for y'all. So, yeah, your girl, um, 
kind of had an NFL player. I guess you can say slide in her DM, something like that. I don't fucking know. But, um, yeah, like I said, I do have the receipts. I'm going to put them on the screen for y'all to see, like, the whole DM and stuff. So y'all can see how boring he was and how he didn't really interest me at all. Um, but yeah, I hope y'all guys enjoyed that story. If you want me to do any more story times, then make sure that you follow me on Instagram because I do put polls up to get you guys kind of like idea what I should do, um, and get what you're interested in. So make sure you follow me on Instagram and make sure that you turn my post notifications on, on YouTube and both Instagram. That way you can be notified when I post on both of those and you don't miss any updates. So yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And once again, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I love you guys so much. Bye.